Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're back with another crochet braid install. Don't mind my edges. I'm gonna hook those up before the end of this video. But this install is gonna be very versatile and you're not gonna have to use any leave out. Now my hair has been braided prior. I actually got passion twists done by a stylist in Dallas maybe about two weeks ago. And I decided to take those down and I was able to easily transition into crochet braids from the braid pattern that she did. And I'll leave her information down in the description box if you guys are interested. I got this hair from Diva Trust, and this is their Outre Expressions Twisted Up Springy Afro Twist Hair. I actually thought it was gonna come pre-twisted, but when I learned that it was already pre-fluffed and everything and you had to actually twist it up, I was like, oh, we about to do a whole lot with this hair. I got about six packs of this hair, but I only needed two packs. I actually only ended up using Using about one and a half packs but if you don't want yours as full as mine you can get away with only using one pack that's if you're gonna wear it out now this is what it looks like on the ends it's already pre coiled which gives you like a twist and curl type look because of the texture these are all the products that I use the hair I got some edge tamer a baby hair brush crochet needle crocodile clips a sleeping cap and these are all from diva trance I did switch up my edge tamer though and I'll talk about that later. So getting to this hair y'all, I love, love, love that it was already pre-sectioned so it kind of saved me the time of having to figure out what size to use. So I just took it apart based on where the curl was, evened it out, and then proceeded to install it into my hair. Now in the back I'm doing a really standard method of installing so I'm just inserting the needle attaching it to the hair, pulling the hair through, and then once the hair is through, there's gonna be a little loop that's created or an opening. So you're just gonna put your finger through and then take the hair on the opposite side and pull it through that loop. Really easy, and it kinda looks really fat and chunky in the back, but don't worry, it's really not a big deal because of how we're styling the hair. And if you're concerned that this braid pattern is a little intricate for you, don't fear, you don't have to do this particular braid pattern. This is just the braid pattern I already had and I didn't wanna take it down without trying these crochet braids. So you can actually do the braidless technique that I've shown in a number of my videos and I'll link those in the cards for you guys. So if you can't cornrow, those videos should be very helpful for you. But if you can't cornrow, you can do straight back cornrows. There are a number of different braid patterns that you can use, but I wanted to show you all what this hair can do. So I'm just installing it really standard. I'm gonna do the knotless technique later on. So I'm gonna allow you all to watch this process and then I'll come back on and don't leave the video guys. I'm gonna show you all some really awesome styles with this hair and also what it looks like twisted up with the spring twist. So keep watching. your mind I can tell by the look in your eyes you're not happy with the man you're standing by yeah I've been watching you and him and him and her with his wandering eyes he's not worth your time so come to me I got what you need just know I'll make you my only one, girl. I'll hold you close, never let go. I'll be your friend, do all I can. I whisper, I love you. I'll hold your hand. I'll take care of you. All right, so for those who probably are familiar with the invisible knot method, you noticed that when we got to the front that I began doing that particular technique. But I was grooving to the music a little too much, so I wanted to get to a certain part and then share it with you guys. So here we are. I've already inserted the hair. Now the only difference with this particular technique is that you're gonna bring only one part of the hair through. So let me show you all again. So you're gonna insert the needle, pull the hair through, create an opening, put your fingers in, and then one side is gonna be pulled through the loop. You're not gonna pull both strands of hair through the loop for this particular technique. And this is gonna create a really nice flat lay 
in the area where your braid is so that it looks as though it potentially grew out of your scalp. I do also want to mention that as I get closer to my front hairline and also where I want my part, that I am splitting the hair more so that the sections are smaller. And I did skip a braid, but I'm gonna go back and fill it up when I twist it up later. So we're gonna insert, pull it through. Only one section is gonna go through. Now it is gonna create a bit of frizz on the ends, but just cut that as you feel necessary. So we're gonna do it again, inserting the needle, opening it up, and then pull one section of the hair through. Don't pull both of those through. And as you can see, it looks really natural that way. And because this hair is really textured, it's also going to cause you not to see any of the loops and the braids are gonna be concealed really nicely. I'll make you smile, look deep in your eyes. I'll ease your mind, kiss you just right. I whisper, I love you. I'll make you mine. Uh, I'll take care of you. It's funny how you came across my path, yeah. I can give you that good love and that will last. So place the other mister in your past, yeah. You know it's true that you're y'all so at this point i realized this is a style we can have some braids on the side have the real big chunky fro in the back and we can go out like this and it'd be really cute so i'm just grabbing my edge tamer and i'm actually slicking down my baby hair after i've done this guys i am going to add some accent jewelry and if you want to stop here girl go for it you're going to be looking really really fly hot girl summer is that what they say <laughs> i'll hold you close Never let go I'll be your friend Do all I can I Whisper I love you I'll hold your hand I'll take care of you I'll make you smile Look deep in your eyes I'll ease your mind Kiss you just right I whisper y'all so at this point i cannot stand how gorgeous this style turned out i was not expecting for it to look this good but we're gonna fill it up on the side and show y'all you can do a lot with this hair so this is how much hair i have in my second pack y'all see this hair is it's legit you can get a lot out of this hair you get a good amount of bang for your buck I believe each pack was like $7.99 and I only used two packs. So that's about $16 total. If you only go with one pack, you've literally got a style for like $8. You can't beat that. So we're just going to fill it up and I'm going to show y'all how fly and beautiful it's going to look after this. I keep saying fly. What's up? <laughs> I'll hold you close. So I decided to go back to the edge effect. That one really lays my edges much better. The other only lasted for a few minutes and my edges were like, girl, what is this? <laughs> so I decided to put that on and it looks so much better. This is what it looks like with the knotless method that I did. I did miss the front. I went and got that. And this is the final look if you want to stop here. This is a style that just keeps on giving. We got more to give, so y'all keep watching. I'm gonna show y'all some more styles. I'll make you smile, look deep in your eyes. I'll ease your mind, kiss you just right. I whisper, I love you. I'll make you mine. Uh, I'll take care of you. I'll hold you close, never.
video i hope that you all thoroughly enjoyed it be sure to check the link in the description box for this hair also like comment subscribe i'll see you all in my next one bye guys